Magandang umaga sa inyo. Good morning. Morning Philippines. This is uh, Roy Lugoles, uh, former National Security Advisor and uh, former Congressman for six terms. I would like to talk about a very important and urgent uh, matter that uh, came out yesterday. This is about Benham Rice. Benham Rice is a big body of water about 13 million hectares big east of the Philippines, uh, east of Luzon. Uh, this is uh, of uh, Aurora and uh, also Isabella. This was awarded to us by the United Nations in April 2012 after we filed a cl uh, claim in April uh, 2009 uh, before the United Nations. Now, this is very important because this is not uh, just uh, part of our exclusive economic zone, but this is part of Philippine territory. This was declared as part of the Philippine continental shelf by the United Nations. Last uh, January uh, this year, I issued a warning. I warned ako at ito ipinablish ko sa Twitter, sa email, sa Facebook, uh, at sinabi ko dito na ako'y na na nangangamba na nagkaka-interes ang China dito sapagkat maraming nabalitaan na mukhang uh, nagmamadyag na sila roon sapagkat napaka-importante din para sa kanila ito. At uh, nagbigay ako ng warning, sabi ko, kailangan magbantay tayo, we should be very careful, uh, we should protect uh, our territory because uh, this is, uh, we have complete sovereignty in Ben Amrise. Now, yesterday, a big news came out. Secretary of National Defense, uh, Del Lorenzana, made a statement that the Armed Forces of the Philippines, the Department of National Defense, cited a survey ship prowling, loitering in our Benham Rice, uh, in our own territory. Now, this is uh, very alarming because there is no reason for that uh, Chinese survey ship to be there. They cannot claim uh, innocent passage, for example, because Benham Rice is not uh, part of the traditional sea lanes. Walang dahilan para nandun yung survey ship doon. At ang maaring dahilan lamang and the only reason why that survey ship, uh, the Chinese survey ship, is there is uh, because of uh, what I would consider uh, very sinister intentions, and that is uh, to survey an area where they have a keen interest, where later on they might uh, try to grab, and we know the history of China in our exclusive economic zone. We know what happened in 1994 and in 1995 in the Mississippi Reap, when they grabbed Mississippi Reap, constructed a uh, temporary structure there. At first they said it was temporary, but after a few years they constructed a permanent structure in Mississippi. We know what happened in Scarborough Shoal. In 1999, I delivered a privileged speech uh, in uh, Congress warning about what I felt was the targeting of uh, China on Scarborough Shoal. A lot of people did not believe me, some people accused me of being an alarmist, and we know what happened in Scarborough Shoal. In 2012, China seized Scarborough Shoal, and until now, they still control Scarborough Shoal. And now, here's Benham Rice. Benham Rice, I would like to reiterate, is part of uh, Philippine territory. And I would like uh, to, to show you uh, how it, uh, it looks like. Kung bakit napaka-importante Itong, uh, Benham, ito ang uh, Benham Rice. Ayan. Ayan ang Benham Rice. Ito ang uh, body of water. No? Ito ang Luzon. Napakalapit niyan sa, kat katikit yan sa Luzon. Ito ang boundary niyan. Ito ang Philippine Basin. Ang laki nito ay 13 million hectares. Ngayon, gaano kalaki ang 13 million hectares? Ang, ter ang uh, original size ng Philippine territory ay... Uh, uh, 30 million hectares. Nadagdag yung 13 million hectares. Kaya ngayon, ang Philippine territory in total ay 43 million hectares. Tingnan nyo kung gano'ng importante ito. This very strategic. At uh, pag ito ay okupahin na naman ng China, nako, napakalaking banta sa ating seguridad at malaking epekto nito sa ating teritoryo. Kaya ngayon pa lamang, dapat importante, I would like to urge the Philippine government to file a very strong protest against the presence and the visit 
of the China server ship in Ben Amrais. They have no business uh, being there. Kaya dapat magprotesta tayo ng malaki dito. Kasi pag hindi tayo magprotesta, baka sabihin ng China hindi tayo interesado. At uh, pag nagkaroon ng vacuum dyan, baka gigising tayo one day na marami ng barko ng China dyan sa lugar na yan. Kaya I would like to urge and I would like to congratulate uh, Defense Secretary Del Orinsana for making this announcement and uh, for also issuing a warning about the possible interest of China in our own Benham Rice. I'd like to reiterate, dapat mag-file ang Department of Foreign Affairs ng isang malakas at mariin na protesta sa presensya at pagbisita ng Chinese service ship dito sa ating Benham Rice. Maraming po salamat.